You shattered the mystique. Yeah. Um, you know, it's funny. I've been uh, your elected official since 1997, uh, so 24 years. So it was a great opportunity for me to do a lot of things in my life. And one of the things, though, that uh, happened many years ago was I was the house leader. I had JT's job for 12 years, I think. And during that time, I had to work on winning elections. And I met this gentleman in Bellevue who was working on the as the state party ED, and he was working on the Dino Rossi campaign. Remember, we won that one. And um, twice. twice. Um, but uh, I, I met this gentleman and was super impressed with him. And he was able to bridge a divide between all the elected officials. And if you don't think that takes some tact and talent, you have no idea how much air congressmen suck out of a room. And, and being able to balance a governor in congressional races and, and, of course, the most important races, the House races and the Senate, sometimes important Senate races. Um, but he was able to do that. He managed people very well. Fast forward, he decides that he's going to become a lawyer and go to law school and do all these great things. And I'm at the rooftop, and he shows up at the rooftop there's a shameless plug for rooftop over here. Um, and he comes in and I'm like, well, why are you here? And he's like, I live here now. And it was great. It was great seeing him again. And we reconnected and we've become very good friends. And our community, having somebody like Peter fill in and, and become your state representative will be incredible. Um, I think about what it takes to navigate Olympia today. It's a lot faster and a lot rougher than it used to be, which makes me sound like a curmudgeon because I'm gonna talk about the good old days. Yeah. But, um, and he's like a 2.0 version of I think everything that I could do. And he's gonna be faster, stronger, swifter, better. And one of the things that you need to understand, there's three things it takes to win a campaign. And, and one of them is a strong family and he has a strong family and Holly is such a support for him. And he, Second is you gotta like to communicate, you gotta like the doorbell. And how many people know Peter likes the doorbell? Ha, ha, parades, Peter loves this stuff. And uh, so he'll do really well at that. But last thing he will do better than I think anybody imagines is fight for us in this room, fight for Lewis County. And when I say fight, I choose that word carefully because we are in a fight. Our way of life is under attack all the time. And we need somebody who can go there and not only stand their ground, but also navigate in order to make bad things palatable and get good things through. And it takes a special craft to do that. And so many people go to Olympia and come and go, and very few, I think, will hit the ground as well as Peter will. He is, he's, I think, going to be tenacious in this campaign. He's got a lot of work ahead of him, but with our help, he'll get there. He'll win this election, and then he can continue the legacy of strong representatives in our state. He's a great friend to everybody in this room. He's a great friend to me personally, and he's a wonderful advocate for our community. Ladies and gentlemen, Peter Obama. Stand up. It's a better photo.